Alright, what up guys? So I told you I bought a racing game. Right now it's simulating. I actually got to first place. It's the fifth lap out of 15. But anyways, I told you guys got a wheel. So let me get it. There it is. Actually, let's turn this down. Here it is. It's a Thrustmaster T300 RS. Let me get out so I can show you a better look. Now here's my TV. Here's the PS4. There's a PlayStation 3 under there too. But I built this with uh, my girlfriend's dad. He builds houses for a living, so he made this in like five minutes. I bought the wood and spray painted it. I just have a blanket and a, pl a pillow my grandma made me because this is an office chair. And as comfy as it is, my butt starts to hurt after a while. And cats have made it their chair. But anyways, I used to have the G27, so here would be a shifter because the T300 doesn't come with one. And there's the pedals. The G27 had three, a clutch, a brake, and a gas. So I'm thinking maybe, because I don't know how much I'll actually play this game, I would get a shifter, but I don't know. So it's kind of like a racing rig. It works really well. My room's a mess. This is uh, for pajama day at work. Desk is overtaken by random crap. Don't even work on it anymore. We got the mini fridge full of non-essentials. Yeah, I mean, the game itself is decent. I mean, it's kind of short because you have everything unlocked already. Everything's unlocked. You only have a certain amount of cars to race with and only a certain amount of tracks. But it is actually much harder than Gran Turismo to drive. I have all assists off, so no traction, no brakes, um, nothing helping me. And it's pretty darn hard to keep control of some cars because you start out with cold tires so you're just burning rubber if you're not careful some good news is I might actually review my girlfriend's uncle's 2015 STI 2015 with only 8,300 miles and he's owned it just under two years so bone stock except for rally armor mud flaps let's try and make up some ground here off the lights keep it clean and keep your wits about you This is all assists off, and they're level 80 racing out of 100. Oops, locked up the brakes. And this is Sonoma. space right here.
problem with this game is the physics. When you are behind another car and you're going in for the brake, the AI for some reason just brakes in a straight line and they won't turn and they just lock you in, which is weird. And I don't, I mean, they don't check their blind spots obviously. used a helmet. The sound gets a little deep and then things start to blur. I definitely feel some damage through the wheel. It's shakier on left turns.